now at fathomevents.com. Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. We continue our Summer Under the Stars tribute to Gary Cooper right now with the romantic film he made near the end of his long career. It's Love in the Afternoon, released in 1957, co-starring Gary with a, another Academy Award winner, Audrey Hepburn, plus an old friend of Cooper's from the days when both men were stars at Paramount Studios, Marie Chevalier. And interestingly, years earlier when both Cooper and Chevalier were fellow contract players at Paramount, both were playing romantic leads. Now, Cooper was still wooing the leading lady, but Chevalier is playing the leading lady's papa. One wonders how Chevalier felt about that when he'd show up for work every morning. This is one of the rare comedies Cary Cooper made in the latter part of his career. Much earlier, he'd done several comedies, but most often in the late 40s and 50s, Cooper had been starring in westerns, adventure stories, and dramas. Love in the Afternoon is also the first movie that Cooper ever made in Europe. It was filmed on location in Paris and at the studio de Boulogne. Now, at the time Gary Cooper was coming off one of the great successes of his career, William Wyler's film, Friendly Persuasion. And once again, in our movie, it's Coop paired with another top director, Billy Wilder. Now, he was not Billy Wilder's first choice to star in this movie. Wilder had written the film with Cary Grant in mind. But as Wilder later said, he, he pretty much wrote all of his films with Cary Grant in mind. Interestingly, right about the time this movie was released, both Cary Cooper and Cary Grant were profiled in a Life magazine article entitled, Cary and Gary Remain Frisky Past 50. Grant was 53, Cooper was 56. And Cary seemed eternally youthful, but Billy Wilder always said that the day after I signed Gary Cooper, for Love in the Afternoon, he got old. Chevalier was also getting older, but entering what would be one of the most productive and acclaimed periods of his career. The following year, Chevalier had his great success as an old French roué in the film Gigi, and won an honorary Academy Award for his contribution to the world of entertainment for more than half a century. So here with Audrey Hepburn's clothes, designed by Hubert de Vinci, from 1957, released by Allied Artists, Love in the Afternoon. Mm -hmm. 